Welcome to DIY Saturday with me, your host, Shandera. Hey, all you savvy naturalistas and Ohana, welcome to another episode of DIY Saturday. Summer is here and I am full of excitement because this is my heavy scrub season. I love to make salt scrubs, sugar scrubs, and lots of scrub recipes during the summertime. And for today, I have a lovely pink Himalayan sea salt body scrub recipe for you guys to use while you're in the shower to remove all those dead skin cells. So let's get into the major ingredient you'll need for this DIY Saturday. If you can guess it, you will need pink Himalayan sea salt and it looks something like this, you guys. And you can find this sea salt at any grocery store. I prefer to, to buy it in bulk. You can find it in a wholesale supply store. I am gonna leave a link down below where you guys can purchase this Easy Pin Kimberley and Seesaw. Also, if you cannot find the finer grade for a very cost-effective version, here's a tip for you. You can buy it in bulk with the large crystals and all you have to do is either blend them in your food processor, blend it, in your blender or blend it in like a spice grinder and you will have your fine grade of pink Himalayan sea salt. You guys said this recipe is gonna be easy and really simple to make. I prefer the finer grade because the crystals help remove dead skin cells and it will not be as harsh on the skin as the large grade of crystals when we're making this body scrub. So you guys, Let's go make this really cool pink Himalayan sea salt body scrub and let's go! Okay, so now we're going to make our lovely, beautiful Himalayan salt scrub, which is a pretty rose color. And this is just a beautiful salt scrub that I enjoy during the summertime. Many of you know when the summer season starts, I tend to enjoy making scrubs to exfoliate the body and skin. So we're going to start off with one cup of Himalayan sea salt. However, you can use any sea salt you like. We're just going to do a cup and we're also going to add a quarter cup of Himalayan sea salt to our already cup of salt and you just want to add that. Now we're going to add a tablespoon of kaolin clay. However, if you do not have kaolin clay, you can use any clay you like. So we're just going to add a tablespoon. This is just an optional step. I just enjoy the kaolin clay because it tightens the skin and kaolin clay are uh, white china clay as we like to call it in the beauty industry. It's wonderful. Uh, clay for the skin. So you just want to mix this all together just to make sure all your ingredients are incorporated into your pink salt scrub, you guys. So mix that in really, really well. Now, you can find this uh, white kale and clay at your local Walmart. You can find it at any store you like. I prefer to buy it in bulk at Winco. However, if you do not have a Winco anywhere near you, just go to the bulk section of your local grocery store and you can find it there. So to this mixture, we're going to add our oils. We're going to use a coconut oil. I'm going to start off with a half a cup of coconut oil, you guys. This is a quarter cup, so I'm going to do this twice. So one and two. I really do enjoy salt scrubs in the summer you guys i really do it's just like one of my favorite things so to that we're going to add our Marico glow oil you can find Marico glow oil at savvynaturalisa.com Marico glow oil does contain 24 karat gold as you can see and this is an all-natural oil that is very multi-purpose and you can put it on your skin you can put it on your face in any part of the, your body after you put it on your face or your skin, please make sure you add a sunscreen before you go out because it does contain a lovely orange 
essential oil scent, you guys. So you can find Miracle Glow Oil at SavvyNaturalisa.com. Once we've added our Miracle Glow Oil, now we're going to add our essential oils. My essential oils of choice is an orange essential oil that I found at Amazon. I will leave a link down below. And I'm also using uh, a lavender essential oil that I found at Amazon at well by now uh now i think it's called now the company is called now and i really love now because as i've always told you now is a perfect essential oil that you can get more bang for your buck so what we're going to do is we're going to make our essential oil blend and we're just going to add it to our pink himalayan salt scrub so i'm going to do about 40 drops of orange and now we're going to add 20 drops of lavender uh, lavender essential oil. So we're just going to do 20 drops. And this just is a perfect blend. If you are a fan of orange and lavender, you will love this blend. And so we're going to mix it together. Also, I'm thinking about doing another giveaway for my um, skincare products. So if any of you would like that, please let me know. Just make sure you blend this up together, you guys, really fine and nice, just to make sure all your ingredients are incorporated. As I've said, the kale and clay is optional. Your scrub will probably look a little less dark if you add you don't add the kale and clay i just prefer to add it and this is a heavy moisturizing base scrub so if you do not want it to be too oily you can i go down to a quarter cup of coconut oil but i wanted a heavy base one because right now i do live in the desert so our climate is a little dry so i want to add just enough moisture into my skin where i'm not putting too many creams on i'm just using my miracle glow oil not a heavy a light cream because when it gets really hot in the desert a light cream is all you need if you're using an oil base scrub when you're in the shower or in the bathtub so to that we're going to add glycerin many of you know I do like to add glycerin to my scrubs and we're just going to add 20 drops of glycerin glycerin is a humectant that adds moisture to the skin you guys it's perfect 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 for the weather we are having So once all your ingredients are mixed together, your Himalayan pink sea salt scrub is all done. Let's do a close up, you guys. Look how beautiful this scrub looks and it smells delicious as well. There you have it, an easy pink Himalayan salt scrub that is perfect for the body and revitalizes the skin cells. Make sure you pick up Miracle Glow Oil at SavvyNaturalista.com. Thanks so much for watching. Make sure you subscribe to my channel and you're following my social media sites. Thanks so much for watching this DIY and I'll see you in our next episode of DIY Saturday. Boy, you guys.